This isn't bad driving. I don't know what it is. This driver is having a really hard time picking a lane to drive in. You just gotta shake your head sometimes at the things that these drivers do. Idiot. Both these lanes continue to the tow lane, but the driver of this misfiring Cadillac doesn't know that, and well, you'll see. <laughs> Finger man, I heard about you. <laughs> Driver of this minivan improperly put on their registration sticker, and that explains everything about how they drive. Observe. You don't know how to properly put your registration sticker on. That explains everything about how you drive. There's a cyclist just riding his bike on the road, and that's fine. The problem here is the driver of this minivan ahead is scared to go around him, which leaves us all going at the speed the cyclist is going. After about five minutes of this, I can't take it anymore, and listen. This causes the cyclist to move out of the way. Not quite the intended effect, but well, it works. Kia driver cuts over the goal point twice. Then later, a Jeep driver attempts the same thing, and I shut it down. To continue toward 990 West, I-94 West. Brutal. And here are a couple of Wisconsin drivers that do the same thing. Wisconsin driver fails to yield when making the right on right. Wisconsin driver runs the stop sign coming out of Jewel. And then fails to attain the speed limit. Well, of course, the Wisconsin driver is not going to know how a right of way at a stop sign works. Here's yet another Wisconsin driver being aggressive in Illinois. Will he start tailgating me? And then, well, you'll see what he does next. Here's a Wisconsin driver that sucks at driving in their own state. The Chevy driver had the intention of letting everybody pull out when that's not how it works. Driver of this piece of crap Buick is well just stupid.
driver can't afford to pay attention and nearly cuts me off. No one can navigate this collector distributor ramp properly, like this minivan for example, under the speed limit and still can't stay in the lane on the curb. Driver of this piece of crap Chevy stops to let an equally piece of crap Nissan end. Why don't you got that piece of crap car in front of us? Distracted, on the phone, not paying attention. Go! Proceeds to drive under the speed limit. Remember, this is closer than it looks. Indiscriminately changes lanes right in front of me without, you know, making sure that nobody was coming. Seems that drivers in this apartment complex will never Understand that this is a violation and the age of this clip just shows how long this has been going on. Are you trying to hit me or something? Subaru driver hesitates to get going. And then rolls through this stuff. Pickup driver struggles with curves, can't stay in the line, and can't stay off the brakes. Meanwhile, I stay perfectly in the line and don't use my brakes a single time. Here's another driver that struggles with curves. I'm wishing to pass this truck, but this Cadillac driver with a misfiring engine is complicating that. Go! Slows down again for the next curve after this. Scion driver, after being cut off, just hesitates to get going again. The ability to plan ahead is an essential driving skill which this Jeep driver lacks and you'll see that with how he blindly backs out across lanes. And that is it for this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Here's a preview of the next episode. And we are past the halfway point of 2022. So time is running out for you to change your driving habits.